So I've been using card scrapers more and more and I appreciate how much quicker they are than sandpaper at uh, removing material. Currently I'm just using a, a flat file to achieve that burr on the edge of the scraper. But in this video I had the idea of turning a 404 chainsaw file into a burnisher. So if you've seen some of my other videos you'll see that I do a fair bit of chainsaw work and as a result I wear out quite a few of these steel brand 404 chainsaw files. The beauty of using uh, one of these as a burnisher is that they're made out of extremely hard steel, hard enough to cut what is essentially the tool steel of the chainsaw chain and hard enough to put a burr on the edge of a card scraper. Another advantage of, of these files is that they're pretty easy to find and relatively cheap. So all we have to do to turn the file into a burnisher is smooth out those teeth. And the only trick to that is we can't let the file get too hot otherwise it might lose its temper and thus its hardness. So that took about 15 minutes, but I've got it as smooth as I can using the belt sander. Now I'm just going to use some 400 grit sandpaper and the drill to uh, smooth it up. So I actually had to go back to 120 and work my way through the grits but I've got a nice smooth rod now so let's give it a go at sharpening the scraper so I use the file to clean up the edge now it's ready to use the burnisher to put on the burr so I'll do that just by running this along the edge a slight angle and I'll do both sides So let's see how well it cuts. So here's a bit of red gum. So the chainsaw fire works like a charm. So if you have any steel 404 chainsaw files, don't throw them out. You can turn them into a card scraper burnisher. Hope this was useful and thanks for watching.